Bob Lazar is a figure of significant controversy within the UFO research community. In 1989, he emerged as a central character in a series of claims regarding extraterrestrial technology in the United States government's alleged activities at the highly classified Area 51 facility. Lazar's narrative centered on his supposed employment at a covert site known as S-4, situated near Area 51. He asserted his role involved the reverse engineering of propulsion systems from recovered extraterrestrial spacecraft, leveraging his expertise in physics and electronics. The case garnered significant attention for several reasons. Firstly, it thrust Area 51, a location shrouded in secrecy, into the public spotlight. While the CIA acknowledged its existence in 2013, the facility's operations remain heavily classified. Secondly, Lazar provided detailed descriptions of the purported alien craft, including their propulsion mechanisms, which he claimed utilize an element beyond the periodic table. However, Lazar's assertions have faced substantial scrutiny. Verification of his employment at S-4 has proven elusive, and attempts to confirm his educational background at prestigious institutions like MIT and Caltech have been unsuccessful. Further compromising his credibility are admitted past criminal activities. Convictions for pandering in 1990 and the illegal sale of chemicals in 2006 cast a shadow over his narrative. These factors have led a significant portion of the scientific community and UFO researchers to dismiss Lazar's claims as a hoax. Nonetheless, he retains a dedicated following among believers in extraterrestrial life and the UFO phenomenon.